I had a stroke which led to bleeding on my brain. I would not survive, I was going to die. In, because in Uganda they didn't have the right equipment to treat my problem. She came with a diffuse subarachnoid hemorrhage in very bad shape. When she arrived, she was unconscious with inability to move her right upper and lower limbs. From the time we came to this hospital to the time I was discharged, the doctors have been very good. Hello, my name is Stella Virunji. I'm from Kampala, Uganda. On the 23rd of January this year, I had a stroke which led to bleeding on my brain. I was taken to a Ugandan hospital to manage my condition, but the neurosurgeon there told us that if they didn't transfer us to this hospital, Yashoda Hospital, for further management, I would not survive, I was going to die. Because in Uganda, they didn't have the right equipment to treat my problem. The neurosurgeon there arranged with my family and they flew me to India on the 31st January to have brain surgery. And when we reached here, I had two procedures done on my brain by Dr. Rajeshka Reddy with a team of other doctors. And both operations were very, very successful. From the time we came to this hospital to the time I was discharged, the doctors have been very good. The nurses, the whole medical team here is excellent. The services are excellent. The room, the facility itself is world class. It is a very beautiful hospital with very good facilities. The rooms are very clean and good. The housekeeping staff and everybody here is very friendly and good. Actually, to the effect that on 16th Feb was my birthday and the doctors gave me a surprise birthday party and that was very, very special. It really touched my heart and gave me a good impression of, of the people here and the staff at large. We've had a very good experience here, I can say, and I would recommend everybody to come here if they have any surgical issues that this hospital can handle. The doctors are very friendly and caring. We are now ready to go back to Uganda and all I can say is that I'm in good health. I've been treated very well. I'm in good health physically and mentally because I had the best, best services here in the Ashoda Hospital. Thank you very much. Hi, I am Dr. Ashik Reddy. I am a neurosurgeon at Ashoda Hospital, High Tech City. We came across a patient from Uganda. Her name is Stella. She came with a diffuse subarachnoid hemorrhage in very bad shape. She was unconscious with the weakness of uh, right-sided limbs. With the diffuse subarachnoid hemorrhage. With that history, she landed in Hyderabad. We investigated her and found that she is having an ICA aneurysm. For her, we treated her aneurysm with endovascular coiling and flow diverter. After the procedure, she recovered completely and uh, again she is able to walk and she is flying back to her own country. I want to spread this message to everyone so that we need not fear about the vascular disease of the brain. We can treat them either with surgery or endovascular treatment with good outcomes. Thank you. Hello everyone, I am Dr. Nikhil, Consultant Vascular and Interventional Radiologist at Eshoda Hospitals High Tech City. Mrs. Stella, a case of intracranial bleeding, when she arrived, she was unconscious with inability to move her right upper and lower limbs. And when she came in, we thoroughly investigated her and she was found to have an intracranial ICA aneurysm. And rupture of this aneurysm was the cause of her bleed. She was advised both surgical as well as endovascular options. And due to the safer nature of endovascular surgeries, they opted for the endovascular option and she was treated with coiling and flow diverter placement. And currently she has fully recovered and she is good for discharge and she has been discharged in a conscious state and she will be flying home today. 
I am happy to see her progress and endovascular surgeries can be useful in treating difficult aneurysms which are not suitable for clipping. Thank you.